All right, Debbie, so today we're gonna to talk about four different business models that you can use to make money online. Along with that, we're gonna do a $500 cash giveaway to the people that are on live and top commenters. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna give away half the money here live and the other half to top commenters. So in the meantime, it's now a Sunday morning, or for me, it's morning, it's 2 p.m. in the afternoon. Uh, we're just warming up the live stream. Let's see what's going on. All right, we got All Wayne Gray, always on. Shot Nick, always on, welcome back. Felicia, always on. How's it going? It's me. Don't think I've recognized you before. Pool Poo. So guys, make sure you stay on. I'm giving away $500 in cash on this video. We're going to give away $250 live and another $250 in the top commenters. We got Pres uh, Pressman. He says, my name is Jeff. What's up? We have Daniel. How's it going? I don't think I've seen you on da uh, Daniel. Diego. We have Austin. We have Nick. We have Kids Superheroes. How's it going? Tyler Bryant. What's up, man? See you all the time. SB Films. Welcome back, my friend. We have Dennis Dunbar, we have Diego, we have Noam, what's up? What's up, Noam, good to see you on. Noam's uh, one of my one of my top students. How much you make now, Noam? Just curious, if you don't mind sharing. I think Noam got his start uh, with my Deadbeat Super Affiliate System. He um, He's doing really well now. Just curious what your, um, you know, what your, if you don't mind sharing, Noam, like what's your average daily income now? We got uh, Miles, we have Chris, we have uh, Jackson. We have Rashawn. We have Windows again. Chris TV in the house. Good to see you. Uh, we have Daniel says I finally got a shout out. All right, guys. So we're gonna do we're going to uh, do a cash giveaway. I'm gonna talk about the four online business models that are basically if you to summarize all the ways to make money online, they fall within these four these first uh, four categories. So lyrical assassin says I bought your course with the last money I had and it was worth it. Good, good, good job, Noam. I mean, uh, lyrical assassin. So Noam's killing it. Noam's doing eight hundred a day. Is that USD on average? Good job, dude. It's all following my Deadbeat Super Affiliate System. Really proud of Noam. He's really, he really hit the ground running with that. Um, all right, wow, man, this cash giveaway looks like it's the way to go. All right, let's jump on in. So let me just talk, what I'm going to do is I'm going to, we're going, I'm going to teach the lesson first and then we're going to give the cash giveaway. The give, the contest is going to be based off the information that I, um, I, I, I'm going to teach in this video. So just real quick, Chris Trunt says, I just bought your course. Couldn't love it anymore. Says couldn't love it any more than I do since I'm a broke college kid. Glad you like it. Glad that you enjoy it, uh, Chris. All right, so let's start. So there's four ways to make money online. Primarily, I focus on two of the four. But there's also benefit in doing the the, uh, the other two that I'm talking about. So let me just pull over my screen here. Hopefully you guys can see this. Uh, it usually messes up. We're going to see what happens. Let me just resize a little bit. All right. So the way I look at it is it's kind of a pyramid. This is based off of, I guess, the earning potential and the ability to scale. Now, it doesn't mean that one is better than the other, but there, there's a benefit to each one. So look at this as a pyramid. You have a crudely drawn pyramid here. Let me just make this better. All right, so there's your pyramid of making money online. So first level right here, there's four levels. You got the first level, that's that level. Second level is right here, oops, right here. I'll talk about each level individually in a second. That's level two, level three, and four. All right, so level one is any kind of freelancing. So I don't, I don't really do much of this to make money myself. I pay other people to do it. Reason why is because there's an, there's an issue with scalability as far as freelancing is concerned. Now, that doesn't mean you can't make bank freelancing. So I know like a really profitable freelancing job is copywriting. So I've paid copywriters up to $30,000 to write a sales letter for me. So there's money to be made there. But I'm talking about general freelancing, things like graphic design, some small programming gigs. Unless you're char charging a high dollar value, there's really no way that you can get rich off of freelancing. Now this can be good side money. So if you're, for example, if you have a wife and kids and your ability to take risk is not as great as you could be if you're younger, freelancing might be better for you. So let's say that you're a programmer, you need to make some, some extra side money to pay the bills. Um, that's for you. So let's just say, so it's not, it doesn't mean that's not good. It's just depending on your life situation. So Freelancing, I personally don't recommend that because you're not building a business. So the problem is the moment that you stop working, the moment that the money stops. So there's you, you're making money if you work, but when you don't work, no money for you. So that's the issue. Second level, this is what I, I, I focus on 
personally, and that is uh, affiliate marketing or, or affiliate marketing or influencer marketing. So there's a, a big, let me just write that in here. So there's a big scale of, you know, a lot of things fall in this. So this could even be like things like drop shipping, basically anything where affiliate influencer. So this, like I said, it's a big wide range thing. There's probably three or four different business models that you can fit in here. So let me just put this in real quick. Just bear with me guys. Working my old Photoshop skills, getting the Photoshop going. So you have affiliate influencer marketing. Now, typically what I do after I've, I've got uh, become more experienced is I usually will hire free people on this part of the pyramid, so to speak. It's not a pyramid scheme. This is just the hierarchy of kind of the, the totem pole of making money online. So I typically will hire freelancers because I, I, I'm, I'm willing to take the risk and, and build a long-term income stream. So typically what I recommend here, this is primarily what I focus on, what I teach here on the channel is affiliate marketing. This is what I recommend, this level here. So uh, the, the benefit of this, you have scalability. There's a little bit of risk. So you're, you're spending your money and your time. Sometimes income streams don't catch on, it happens. Um, benefit though is that if you stop working, the money still comes in. So you still got the money sign. If you stop working, money still comes in. I've had, I have income streams that have made money. I haven't touched them in literally like four years. They're still pulling income this to this day. But that's because I took the risk and, um, and, I, and I made the investment and paid other people. So I guess the way you could look at it is the risk. Here's your, your risk graph. It goes up. The risk goes up. But along with that, so does the ability to earn money and have that scalability, ability to make more money without having to put input in. So next level is creating your own products. Products or services. So this could be anything from, let me just do products or services. So this could be like, hold on, let me just adjust. Damn it. Let's do that. Product services. So products and services are a little bit more risky. What I mean by that is you, you typically you have to invest capital or a lot more time. So here, let me just, let me back up here. This is, in my channel here, I'm primarily teaching you these two. This is what I focus on. Uh, pr uh, products and services have their benefits. So the benefits of products and services, you can typically make more money. So more money because you get to keep more of the cut. You can get affiliates to promote for you. That's a big benefit. It's a lot, it's an extra hassle, but having affiliates, having people that are trained to promote your stuff um, is a benefit as well. Savon Tam says that Alex Becker already, already talked about this. Uh, he did, but he has a different perspective than me. So I wanna, I wanna give it from my perspective here. So if you're a beginner, uh, typically I rec recommend you start here. If you wanna start a real business, this is one level up. Reason why is you have added risk because it takes time. And you have to know more. So you have to, is the, the money's an added risk and you have to have the knowledge. Like creating your own product and getting it to sell is about an extra year to two worth of uh, knowledge, in my opinion. So uh, that's just from my experience. The reason why is you have to learn copywriting. You have to learn how to make a web page convert. If you're doing affiliate or influencer, market, uh, influencer marketing, you have the benefit of working with products that have already been tested. You already have an experienced person to sell stuff. So that's the main reason why I recommend you start off as an affiliate. Yeah, maybe there is a little bit more competition, but it, I, I don't really believe it. Believe in that. If you have, if you have a unique thing, you have a good thing to talk about, people are going to listen to what you have to say. By the way, I'm, not, I'm ignoring live streams right now because it's distracting me. So you, uh, and the other benefit is that you have the ability to move up the food chain from here. Like if you have an audience, let me just clear off my, my tablet here. If you have an audience, um, damn it. If you have an audience that you build up from this level here, A for audience, this is valuable all the way up the chain. So you can use that audience all the way up the food chain. Uh, so you're kind of building a long-term, uh, you're building a long-term asset here if you start with affiliate marketing. All right, so you can tell I'm a big fan of affiliate marketing. Products and services, definitely where you eventually wanna go. This is again, after about a year or two, after you've mastered the affiliate marketing game, you have an audience, then it's worthwhile investing in products. So examples of products and services uh, can be anything from supplements. I've seen a lot of health, a lot of health things. You can outsource these to uh, AliExpress if you want to. Um, 
but basically this gives you a little bit more control. Having your own products, there is another level of work though. So you have to make sure you have the customer support. You have to make sure that your, your customers are happy. Uh, it's a little bit more work. Second level, the fourth level, this is the final level. A lot of people strive to create this, and this is a platform. So the way I look at platforms are basically what you do is you create the framework and other people come in and build out your site for you. So an example of this would be something like ClickBank. So ClickBank doesn't really own any products. They might have a couple now, but other people go on their networks and load up their site with products and the platform makes money kind of like a toll booth. So they're just pulling like 5% um, to provide the ClickBank vendors, the product creators with a platform to sell their products on. So you can see how they're all kind of related. The platform is kind of on the top. They just collect the money that all these guys make here. So this is a super high level stuff. I've tried to make a couple of these things in the past. It's very, very hard. Um, there's a lot of, you, you have to basically understand, if you want to build a platform, in my opinion, you have to understand this level for sure, these two levels. So you kind of build up to it. Another example is we have something like Facebook. Um, Obviously, that's an exception to the rule because Mark Zuckerberg didn't really play around too much with this level here. But he was also younger, so younger people can take the risk as far as spending a year or two trying to build a, building a platform and having it fail. If you have a, a kids or you have a family or you have a, a you know bills, here's where you want to stay. Somewhere in here, if, it's, if you're really desperate, right here. All right, so with all that said, let's jump back on in. Let's talk about, let's get some get people's opinions here. Uh, where, where am I? Somewhere around here, not there, right here. All right, so let's just do some comments here. Let's see what we got on. We've got Trumpet Sheets says, sorry for being late. All right, let's talk about what I just talked about. Anybody have any questions? Lyrical Assassin says, right, if I only used all the money that I lost in casino in, to buy courses, I'd be effing rich. Yeah, you'd have more knowledge for sure. You still have to take action, but you know at least you're investing in yourself there. SB Film says, but if you invest in yourself, you have a better chance of getting returns. Yeah, investing in yourself is the best way to get returns. You can't lose money investing in yourself. He says, always have time and money to invest in yourself. Justin R Rowell says, smash that like button. All right, so we're gonna give out. Some, we're gonna start doing some some cash contests here. It's gonna be based off of what I talked about. Before we start, make sure if you could just share this video with your friends or whatever, like it on Facebook, all that good stuff. We'd appreciate that. Uh, now we're going to give into the giveaways here. So this is going to be done over PayPal. First question, I'm going to give away, let me just write this down. This is going to be, so I'm going to give away 250 here on the stream. How am I going to break this up? We'll do 75, 75, uh, 275 giveaways. So that's one, what's that, 150? And then another 100, so we'll do 250s. So we're doing this live. The other half here is going to be on comments. So if you're watching this now on replay, answer the same question by commenting below. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to pick the top commenter. So question number one, I'm going to just write this down. This is $75 on live and this will be and for anyone commenting live and $75 for people watching the replay now. All right, 75, 75. Just by sense. The question is, name five types of freelancing gigs that you can use. So the first person to comment and gives five uh, ideas for freelancing wins. I'm going to pay about PayPal. So it starts right now. <laughs> Top five. I'm going to pick it. So comment it right now. So for 75 bucks live or $75 on comment starting now. All right. Felicia says freelance. Nope. Wrong answer. I need five, not one. All in, it has to all be in one sentence so I can, I can look at it. Don't do it in bits. Have to be at five. Here we go. So Reeves says graphic design. That's one. Video editing, two. Programming, web development, uh, web design. All right, Reeves one. He got it first. So or is it Ravens? Raven S. So Raven S. Can you just type your PayPal in? I'll pay PayPal you it right now. It's Raven S. So seventy five dollars. You gotta be quick, guys. Gotta be quick. Raven S. Raven S. Can you just write your PayPal in the chat right now, PayPal. So again, there's another opportunity to win in the comments. Whoever comments with uh, the top five, top five freelance ideas, uh, will pay an extra credit. Oh, Raven S doesn't have PayPal. Well, oh, that sucks. So that's a problem. Let's see who's number two then. Sorry, Raven S, this is over PayPal. 
All right, Phil Gaming says, question one, graphic design, copywriting. Nope, only did three. Let's see who's next. Daryl Ira, uh, graphic design, copyright. Um, you spelled copyright wrong, wrong type of copyright. MMA upload, Fiverr, Upwork, free image, logo design, brand. It's a little rough. It's not quite what I had in mind. Cream TV, writer, copyright. Uh, nope, you just did two things twice. Best life with Sammy B says making logos, copywriting, article writing, voiceover, graphic design. All right, best life with Sammy B is the winner. Sorry, Raven S, you didn't have the PayPal, <laughs> like a campaign the other way. So, uh, Sammy B, can you just write your PayPal? I'll send it to you right now, $75. Congrats to Sammy B. So if you're, if you're watching the replay, just comment and I'll pick the top five for that. You'll also win $75. Just look out for my, um, my, if I give you the notification that you win. So let me send best life for Sammy B, sending you $75 right now. Hold on, log, I'm logging in real quick in the background. So my PayPal. All right, congrats to Sammy B. So send money, let's do that right now. Queuing it up, $75. Good job, Sammy. All right, add note. Note is top contest winner. What's the date? October 29th. All right, shipping address, no need to ship. All right, Sammy, just send you the 75. Should show up, just send. All right, next question. Next question, let's see here. Let's go, let's move up the totem pole. So this is for another $75. This is for the, if, if you're gonna become an affiliate marketer, that's what you wanna get, get into based off of what I teach in my Deadbeat Super Affiliate System. What is the top way to get, the top way to get free traffic the fastest? If you, know, if you have my Deadbeat Super Affiliate System, you're gonna know the answer. So the, again, the question is, the first person to answer this, or no, we're gonna say the best answer for this, in my opinion, is what's the fastest way to get free traffic to an affiliate site? Okay, we got, uh, YouTube is close, but let's, let's broaden it out a little bit. Free traffic, only free traffic. Ranking on Google, YouTube, close you guys are close you guys are real close it's a little bit more broad so youtube is kind of part of it youtube review invite others to guest post we have social media vlogging youtube is close guys you guys are right you're saying pinterest but what is this all what is the idea the idea behind it video marketing build an audience man people are going nuts i can't keep up whiteboard youtube videos you guys are close Video ranking close, but what if you had to term it all like what is the idea behind using YouTube or let's say Pinterest? I want to I need a sentence here. What's the why does it work? Why does using free educational content, social media marketing, AdWords, social media influence, web 2.0, Carl's pretty close. Capturing someone's t attention. Yeah, I guess it's a uh, social platform engagement. You guys are getting close. Building the audience is getting close. Social signals. It's You guys are in the right area. Free traffic from social media. Marketing with channeling. Close. All right, Mike, I'm going to give it the use videos to rank in Google. Google, it's a web 2.0. Jackson Michael, I think is the closest one. Let's give you a couple more seconds here. All right, so the I'm gonna, I'm gonna get I'm gonna say Jackson Michael's the winner here. He got it the closest. So basically, let me see where are you, Jackson? Let me just see. 
The answer is, is that you're, you're able to leverage existing platforms that already have authority and traffic to tap into them. So YouTube's an answer. Uh, so you're basically using Google properties to give you a benefit that are ranked much faster. Facebook, Pinterest, all that ranks much faster because you're using properties that already have existing authority. So I'm gonna give this to uh, Jackson Michael. Jackson Michael, can you just pay, uh, write me your PayPal? So for the people co uh, commenting after the replay, the question's gonna be name five, five free properties that you can tap into to rank quicker. All right, so I have to change it up because it's a little bit, it's a little bit time sensitive here. So Jackson Michael, what's your PayPal? I'll send you $75 now. Just looking for Jackson Michael, I found you. Let me just send 75. All right, got you there, 7500. Add notes, so this is the free traffic contest winner, October 29th. Okay, no shipping address, send money. So, oh, error on PayPal, what's going on with this? Hold on, I got an error on PayPal. I'll try one more time. Winner cash contest. Damn it, have an issue with PayPal. Let me see what's going on here. Oh, uh, Jackson, I have your I have your email li listed in. I have your info right now. Let me just try to refresh here. I don't know. If there's just a random error popping up. Let me see what's going on. Sorry, guys. Let's see, send money. Goods or services. Are you all good? Everyone good? Sorry, got a little temporary, temporary issue here. PayPal. 75 maybe I, what i should do is for now on just do it after the stream uh contest winner october 29 okay yeah just to show you guys i'm, I'm not like I'm bsing this there's some kind of issue with paypal here uh i don't know what the deal is with that so to get the stream going, uh, Jackson, I have your info saved here. I'm gonna have to PayPal this after the stream's over. Uh, let me just save it. PayPal contest winners, October 29th. All right, so let's do the next question. I'll, I'll, I'll handle this right when we get off the stream. I don't wanna, I'm losing attention right now. Uh, Beer Money says he had this problem. Sometimes it's security stuff. I don't know what's on. what's going on here. I'm gonna get the PayPal to work. Let's see. Ra Ravens, you don't have PayPal, so I mean, I, I said it was the PayPal. There's no other way for me to pay you. I'm like, I literally have no other way to pay. Your money says I have to just try again in another hour. All right, uh, let's see here. Next question. Let's see, 250s. 250s, we're gonna do 250s. All right, question number two is, sorry Ravens, uh, there, I literally have no other way, to, like pay, I said in the beginning it was over PayPal, that was the only way I was gonna pay, I have literally no other method to spend, send money online. So that's kind of the problem. All right, product creator, let's do a question about product creation. This is for 50 bucks. This will be both for live and top commenter. The question's gonna be, What is, this is about product creation. So I haven't talked too much about this, but hopefully we have some people that know a little, little bit, know a little bit more. So the question is gonna be, when you create a product, where is most of the money made? So when you have a product or service, where is the majority of the money made? This is something I haven't talked about yet. Jackson, Justin Dickinson wins. He is on the back end. All right, Justin. 
What's your PayPal? I'll have to add you to the list. That's for 50. So it's Justin Dickinson wins. For people watching on people watching people watching on con, on the replay, Justin, what's your PayPal? It's, it's filling up quick. I need it. For people watching the replay, design a this is for 50 bucks. Design a product funnel, post it in the comments, make it a realistic product funnel with three products. How would you turn that into the most amount of money? So comment below with your idea on how to create a three product funnel. How's it, how are you going to price it? What's it going to be? And I'll pick the top commenter. It's for 50 bucks. All right, Justin wins on live. So that's for 50 also. So if you're watching replay, Justin, I got to do this afterwards. It's a, people are saying I have to wait because there's an issue with uh, PayPal. They're so, PayPal's a pain in the ass, man. All right, last question. Last question. That's going to be who needs standards that didn't say back end first. You, you, Justin beat you. Um, second, uh, this is for $50. Let's see here. Next question is going to be. Uh, this is for 50 bucks. Let me see what it's going to be about. Man, this is tough. This, this is, this is the first time I've done a live thing. All right. Uh, name 10 free traffic sources that you can use to sell both products or affiliate offers. 10 free traffic sources. So the first person to comment 10 free traffic sources gets $50. Let's see. Got, it has to be all in one line. All in one line. Don't just break it down with one at a time. I can't keep tra track of that. All, all has to be all in one, po one post. 10. 10. Daniel only provided five. He sees his face. Too much typing. Yep. Better start typing. Someone's about to win. I can just feel it. it. Has to be all one line. So we got Chris O's is Amazon, Amazon, potentially Amazon, Google, Bing, Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, Craigslist, eBay, Pinterest, YouTube. I said free. Uh, Amazon, you have, to, you have to pay for that. I said didn't win. Close, dude. You're off by one. <laughs> all right. Let's see. Next person we have. Alex Tijan, Google, Bing, Facebook, Tumblr, Instagram, Reddit, Pinterest, Twitter, YouTube, LinkedIn. All right, Alex Tijan wins. Alex Tijan, what's your PayPal? It's fifty dollars. Sorry, Chris, oh, you were close, dude. Alex Tijan, just post your um, your email, your your PayPal email. It's fifty dollars. All right. So for anyone live, watching live, give me 15, I mean, anyone watching the replay, 15 free traffic sources. Comment below. First person to, to do that in the comments wins $50 as well. All right, so that's, I did a 275s. That's 150, yep, 250. So we just did the live money. That's it for the live money. Uh, in the meantime, anyone have any questions about affiliate marketing? I'll answer them now. Congrats to all the winners, by the way. I'm sorry, Ravens, that uh, you don't have a PayPal. That's the only way to send money online for me. So. So we're, we're doing questions Q&A about affiliate marketing or marketing in general. So Emily says, hey, Dan, I'm looking for a niche that, that, that would be good to me, but I don't have a real interest to a specific subject. I'm an economic, uh, an economist. Well, do you, are you interested in money? Do you know about, you, you probably have to be, um, maybe something to do with money. See if that's along your lines. Is the contest over? Yes. The live part portion is, but I do, I'm giving away another 250 in the comments. So if you comment below, if you watch the stream, I, I, I answer, ask questions for live, and I ask questions for re people watching the replay. 
So there's another opportunity to win 250 after this live stream's over. Make sure you jump in. Um, make sure you jump in after the replay and answer those questions. Martin next is how do you avoid spam folder when doing email marketing? So that's a complicated question. Um, there are certain words that trigger the spam, the spam algorithm type thing. So you have to worry about that. Also, um, yeah, email marketing, marketing is actually very complicated. It's simple on the surface. That's why I don't really teach it right away and, and for free stuff. Um, and in, in general, just don't try to be too spammy. So if you're overhyping in emails, using too many things, like if you, if you write the word bank account, if you have dollar signs in there, that can sometimes trigger it. Trigger it. Uh, Pokemon TV, uh, Popcorns TV says, is it possible to start affiliate marketing without a website? Yes, but I recommend that you, you create a website. So I teach that all in my Deadbeat Super Affiliate system. If you start today, uh, probably you won't be able to build your first income stream to, tonight, but by Monday, by Monday night, you should have your first one up. So there's a link to that for that below. I just recommend that you create your own site. You're much better off. The reason why is it gives you more control. If you want to make money online, you have to have control. Now, it doesn't mean you can't make money with, without doing this. It's just that it's a lot more fragile. Jimmy McNeil, yeah, you missed the money. Um, to, the Wild Wolf says, how should I make a good page? So that's a very in-depth, I can't answer that over this. To start, either get my free guide, that's deadbeatuniversity.com slash guide, or upgrade to the my Deadbeat Super Affiliate System. Best way to do it, hands down. Um, or you can watch my YouTube videos. I don't really reveal step-by-step -step how to do it on my YouTube channel, but in my program I do, so it's up to you. Alex Tijan says, when is the con comment contest deadline? Uh, that'll, I'm basically just going to pick people right after I get off here. So if it takes uh, a week for people to get the right answer, it'll be a week. If it takes, it's I'm going to bet it's only going to take a couple hours. So... Zach Self says, I made my first affiliate sale last night, a whole $1. Good job, dude. That's the first, you like, that's one of the hurdles most 99% of the people never get there because they give up. I mean, it's probably an exaggeration, but um, you did the hardest part, in my opinion. Lyrical Assassin says, Dan's program is 100. Guys, get it. Thank you, Lyrical Assassin. What do you think about using fiber gigs to drive traffic to your site? It's, I, I wouldn't, I mean, here, here's the way you have to look at it. If they could send good traffic to your site for $5, they wouldn't be sending it for $5. All they would do is they would promote affiliate offers themselves. So that doesn't mean that's not possible. Like you can get some Twitter blasts. Sometimes that, that can get you some traffic, but you just got to think if it's $5 and they're able to send you thousands of clicks, like thousands of clicks are worth thousands of dollars if they're real people. Lyrical Assassin said he's made 26 bucks so far on Amazon. Hey, Lyrical Assassin, do you mind just commenting on my Facebook page about your success? I know $26 doesn't sound like a lot, but in, in the beginning phases, if you made $26, you just started out, you're doing good. <sighs> if you could just leave it, just you know, a quick sentence about your success. Uh, Paul Wright says, my wife is very sick and has been for the past 10 years. She's been through three brain tumor operations. Wow, that's intense. She's constantly ill. I'm tired of scams. And do you have any idea of how I can help myself? Well, reality is, is that you better start training. You better start becoming smarter, stronger, faster. That's really the, the, the that's the truth. I mean, here, the, info, the info I'm teaching here on my YouTube channel is great. There are a lot of free resources out there to make yourself smarter and better. That's really the only thing you can do. I mean, you can you can hope and pray that you know the miracle is going to happen, but reality is that that doesn't really happen. So the one thing you can do is just make yourself better. And, and that's when I say just, like that's a there's work there. There's a lot of work. This is one way to do it: affiliate marketing. Learning how to sell is another one. Okay, so, you know, I know you're looking for like a magical answer, but that's really the truth. Lyrical Assassin says, I'm broke. I have two kids. So, yeah, it's, it, so yeah, hell, it's amazing to know I can make money online from home with the kids. There's a lot of people doing it. <clears throat> There's a lot of people doing it. 
Uh, Keyshawn says, can you generate a full-time income online by freelancing? Yes, you can. It ta it's going to take time, though. Um, I, had, I had a friend that wanted to get into freelancing, and he dropped. He, he quit his job and you know, thought that he could go full-time into freelancing. But the reality is you have to create a base of customers. And it takes time, one customer at a time. So you might have to first generate a good portfolio. You might have to do work cheaper than you normally would just to start building up some clients. Um, do whatever you can. Christopher G says, why have kids when you're financially unstable? Um, you know, some people just make, uh, get trapped, get trapped. Uh, it's part, there's all, the reality is there's a whole system designed to get you trapped so that you can't break out. We're, we're, every commercial on TV is part of that system. It's designed to get you to spend your money on stuff you don't no, don't need. It's not this big conspiracy. It's just people want you to give them your money to them. And people kind of fall into the, oh, I need the top best car. I need to have a, a house with a family. And I need to do all this other stuff. You don't, you don't need to do any of that, but you know, like some, you get, sometimes you get trapped. You can get out of it though. I know so many people that have fallen into the trap and pulled themselves out. So it's not that it's not possible. It's just going to take a heroic effort on your part, but this can all be trained. This is all doable. So many people are doing it. One, if one person can do it, that means everyone else can do it. Okay. Chaotic Gamer says, Dan, should you create an affiliate site with an e-commerce store, like become your own affiliate? So a lot of people do that. So, um, you can do that. I'm, I'm like technically my own affiliate with a, with a lot of my businesses. So, well, essentially you're just, you, you're selling just, you're, you're doing the same exact thing. The only difference is that you're, you're selling your product directly. Like it's the same exact stuff. All right. So that's like, that's the one thing, like I designed the deadbeat super affiliate system so that you can be use it for an affiliate. You can use it to sell your own products. It's literally the same exact thing. Austin Eggman, Dan, answer my question. I don't know, what's your question? Okay, Austin, let me find you. Okay, says, Dan, what is a better niche site model? A blog, content-based site, site with a store option as a tab in the header or store the blog section on it? Um, that's really just the same thing. You're just, I see what you mean. Um, I, I would make the store my main and then I'd have a really good blog behind it. That's probably the better way. But, well, yeah, that's a good question. Just, ah, uh, man, that's a good question. I, I, I would, it just depends, are you gonna have affiliates or not? That's the, that's the answer. If you're gonna have affiliates, I would put the store up front. If you're gonna just primarily sell your own stuff, I would make the blog your main, your main URL and have the store kind of on the back end. That'd be the better way to do it. But if you have affiliates, I would flop it around, so it would switch around. Okay. <clears throat> okay, so if you're not using affiliates, I would just, I would do content first, blog behind it. Cl Corey Klein says, any advice on how to get approved for offers on JVZoo? Um, I would contact the, the, the product creator. And also what I would do is I would start selling Yeah, like, yeah, it's tough because not people, not many people are gonna approve you uh, if you're new. This guy's annoying. Let me just boot this guy. Um, get like a, a site up first. D. Carvery says, "What does the back end mean? That that means basically building a business behind what you see up front. So, a, a lot of YouTube channels, for example, all they all they do is just focus on AdSense income." But the real money is made on behind the scenes, the business behind the scenes. And this is getting more intermediate to advanced. Okay, Kid Pro, Pro D, DJ says, Dan, you should create a course on branding. That's my new program coming out. There's some, some info, a lot of info on branding kind of embedded in. Jackson Michael says, how do you get approved for CPA networks? Build a site first, call them up. So, you know, sell yourself, say I'm a, I'm a new affiliate, but I have a, a site that's growing quick. I'm really passionate about this topic. Uh, I know I can sell X amount of units per month. Just give me an opportunity. Let me prove myself and I'll, I'll do it. You know, affiliate, affiliates, if you call affiliate networks, if you call them, they're more than likely going to approve you. 
Alex Plogue says Dan, is there less competition in foreign countries when it comes to affiliate marketing? Yes. Some countries are years behind. Like Brazil is one of those markets. They're a few years behind where, where, where the U.S. is right now. So you, like, you, there's a little bit more opportunity there. MMA Upload says you helped me go from two views a day on October 21st of this year to now over 30 views a day and steadily growing. Good job, MMA Upload. Yeah, it's just, it's a snowball type thing. Once you know how to do the right stuff, you got to stack it up each day. So you're doing the right thing. Just do more. Do more of what you're doing. Good work, dude. Corey Klein says, how do you feel about being a traffic vendor? There's a lot of money there if you're able to pull it off. I know a couple guys that do that. They're making bank. So if you can legitimately do it, like you, you're going to want repeat customers. So the traffic has to be real. Uh, that's kind of like the holy grail of internet marketing. WebGo says, how much time do you spend to be a super affiliate? I work right now roughly like two to three hours a day. But at the same time, what, what I consider work is like when I'm actually doing stuff. I'm always learning. I'm always reading though. Uh, here's a good question. Trevor Jones, Trevor Jones says, Dan, I tried to build an affiliate site covering multiple categories, health, tech, and pets, not targeted to a specific niche. Is this a bad idea? All right, so yes, this is a bad idea. In my Deadbeat Super Affiliate System, I explain why. Basically, if what's, what's happening is because your site's about so many different topics, not only is Google and... All, all of the traffic sources getting confused about what your site is about. More importantly, your audience has no clue. When they think about your site, it's on three different topics. So it's really, in their mind, it's nothing. It's just a very broad site. If you want to be successful online, you have to pick one topic and be known for that one topic. So even even know that like on this YouTube channel, for example, I'm, I primarily talk about affiliate marketing and make money online. Now, over the course of time, as the channel grows and as I need to expand a different territory, I'm going to talk about more stuff like investing and money and saving and maybe some debt stuff. I've never really been in debt, so um, I'm probably not going to talk about that. But I'm going to spread out to my making more types of making money because, uh, you know, running out of stuff to talk about here. So, you know, new stuff to pull in new people. So I've already kind of I've already kind of like capitalized the affiliate niche on the affiliate market niche. So that's what you have to do. So let's say you want to start with computers. Uh, let's say you, yeah, let's say you start with computers. You could start, that's too, that's still too broad. Uh, it's still too broad. So let's say you like, just for example, photography here, you can start with photography. Um, you can make a whole, you could spend like years just talking about that. What you would then want to do is branch out to maybe like how to make money with stock photos. That'd be another, a nice little way to segue into something else or uh, video, video editing or something like that. See how they're kind of related. You all want it to be the same, not health, dogs, and tech. It's too, it's too broad. <clears throat> okay. Zimmy Lolly says, what do I do after making $200 a month? I made $200 last month. What should I do now? More of what you've already been doing. So find what's working, do more of it. Usually when you think that you've tapped out a niche market, you're no, you're only, you've only breached the surface. So I've made that mistake in the past, thinking that, you know, like there, there's one example in my head. Um, the first attempt I made at this site, I'm, I'm, I've got it to like $2,000 a month. And I was like, I can't make any more. There's no possible way. Then I tried again a couple years later, and I got up to the six thousand dollars a month. And at that point, I was like, "All right, six thousand dollars a month. There's no way I can make any more off this niche." But then I was like, "You know what? I'm gonna keep doing exactly what I'm doing. I'm just gonna do more of it." And then it finally breached. It almost made um, the top month was twelve twelve thousand dollars. That's exaggerated. It was like eleven thousand. It was like eleven thousand eight hundred dollars in this top month, and it made that pretty consistently. So. It's, it's just a matter of getting more of what you're doing. Okay, man, there's a lot of questions here. Jackson Michael says that you got poor Charlie's uh, Almanac. Yeah, Charlie Mungle's, Munger's Almanac. Yeah, I read, so that's, that's, a, that's a good book. Um, it's right there. 
He says, are you an, an investor? Yes. David Mu Moy says, having enough valuable things to say about a subject or product is my biggest barrier. Wouldn't you say that your biggest skill is your ability to address various subjects in a helpful way? Um, it comes with experience, but you can try to find someone who knows what they're doing. Excuse me, I've done that several times in the past. Someone like someone who's stuck in the bottom rung of the make money online pyramid because you know, like for they have bills they have to pay, they can't venture out and take risks. So you can take that extra risk and pay them the money to do it for you. So that's kind of what it means to be an entrepreneur. Like you pay other people that are afraid to take the risk to do the work for you and you assume the risk instead. So some people just don't like taking risks. They need the money, they can't afford to, you know, they're not made to do that. And by the way, you can train yourself to get better at taking risks. So you're gonna find someone in that situation. I've done that several times. WebGo says, Debbie, super funny. How many videos are on the course? Uh, like 23, but it's not, you know, how many is not the question. It's what, what's in there. T. Hanna says, first time I caught you live. Good job. Good to see you here live. Thanks for the videos. I play them in the background while I'm working on my site. Usually it keeps me going. Glad I could help T. Uh, T. Hanna. Is that your same name, Tiana? Uh, T. T. Anna. Okay. Um, all right. I'm getting tired. I mean, I'm, I'm going to go sleep. All right, Debbie, so this is me for the day. Um, so after the replay, after the replay compiles and it's posted, there's you can win, still win some money. There's two hundred fifty dollars that I'm gonna give away. So apparently there's an issue with PayPal. I just, if you saw that error message, I have to kind of like log back in in like another hour and send the money. So anyone there, um, if you comment, you can get some, make some money there. Also check out my Deadbeat Super Affiliate System. If, if you want to start affiliate marketing, the link's below for that. All right, so with all that said, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, uh, like and share this video with your friends. Also comment below. Uh, uh, also hit that subscribe button. Just got a couple last comments here. R, R, R Kirby says, I've been marketing for 20 years. The video is totally worth the money. Thank you, R Kirby. 20 years, man. You're up there with me. Glad I could help. All right. Thanks for coming out to Beats. Make sure you subscribe. Hit that bell icon so you're notified of any videos that I re uh, release when I release them. I'll see you guys later. Oh, by the way, congrats to everyone who won money.